All right, now I'm going to walk you through a little bit of the Cheetah Builder. So from your back office, from home, we're going to enter the Cheetah Builder. And in this back office, there is this site here that I copied over to this account. And so you can just edit that site and you can go ahead and look at the pages that are on this site. So this site has four pages. It's It's got uh, the home page with the Colorado background and then a thank you page with Colorado background. And then I also did more of a generic home page with just a, uh, a, a teal colored background and the thank you page with a teal colored background. And these pages are really easy to change. So let's We'll go, um, let's go edit, edit this one real quick and just let me show you a few things here. Okay, so um, when you first log in, uh, Builder is going to give you a little bit of tour and help explain to you a little bit about how the menu items work and how to get started and things like that. We're going to skip those for now and get to this page now the way that builder all the drag and drop builder all cheetah builder works is it works off of panels and elements so mm -hmm. this is a panel uh, you can't really see it here but it is a panel as is this is a panel so here you can see it's a panel so panels are just really separate sections of the site and then on this panel we have a text element we have a box element here box and then inside this box element we've got a form contact form element and then we've got a video element and then once you click on any of these uh, you can edit or just right click and then you can go um, so for example the text element you click into it and then you can change your text, you can change font color, background color, um, you can insert icons, and then uh, text shadows. You can do a lot with it. For this particular background, <clears throat> I'm going to click onto it, right click, and then let's go change the background color so I can just kind of show you what happens. So we've got a solid color. We could also do a, a gradient color. So let's do... Uh, Let's do something different. Let's do like a, ooh, that's purple. A purple to reddish color. So that's how easy it is to change the background. And then uh, to change the background, you just save. If you want to add a new element, say we wanted to make this panel bigger, we could just drag that down. And then we could go up here. We could do add element text and then you can choose your different text elements and then just drag them in and then just uh, double click on it get into it and change your text that's that's how simple it is so it is really simple to use and then if you want to go between pages uh, it's easy to do that just click on the page it'll ask you to save I don't want to save so we're going to skip that <clears throat> just leave and go to the other page. Back here on my branded page, uh, this is this this panel background is actually an image. And you can see here that it's a background image. You can change the image or you can remove the image. Uh, let's see, what else do we want to look at here? You can always preview the page. And you can go back to the editor. Uh, this particular text you don't really need. It's not, it doesn't really apply to this page now. So we can delete that. That's fine. Boom, as easy as that. Drag that up. Can drag that up. Um, we can, this is a box. We can, uh, let me, let me, yeah, shift click. Shift click and then move those up together. 
Uh, we can center, we don't want to center these. We can center these on the page. We can center this on the page. Drag that panel up. And that's, that's really how easy it is to use this drag and drop builder. So when we like it, we can do save. And yeah, that's fine. So that's a real basic walkthrough of the Cheetah Builder. Now, something else that's uh, important for you to know is you may not, you probably want to change the, the name of this site, right? So you can go to the settings here. And you can change the name, you can change the home address, title, description. Um, probably don't really need to worry about anything else at this point. And then this initial yes will tell you that this is your home page. So if you, you could copy this page, right, duplicate, and then you could go and you could modify that page and you can then decide, you know what? I want to make this page my home page. And then save it. And now that becomes your home page. Okay, uh, that's enough for this video. In the next video, we're going to go into a little more detail. I'm going to change, show you how to change this uh, magic, this builder on magic form. Thanks.